Hello everyone. Much has happened in the last few days uh, since we met on Friday. I hope everyone is staying safe out there. So um, I've made changes to the uh, schedule and the syllabus. I'll cover those in a second. Um, be sure to check your COD email for updates. As I say in my announcement here, uh, the Dean and the department notified instructors that if we were ready to transition online learning, we should continue with instruction this week. I believe that it's critical in this short eight week course. Um, I don't believe that we could take another week out of the schedule and be successful. So I've spent the weekend revising both the syllabus and the schedule. Uh, I've adjusted some due dates, revised assignment descriptions, we have a new peer review process given the online environment. Um, it is critical that everyone views the screencast and lecture videos as we move forward. I will do all that I can to keep everyone uh, informed and clear on assignments and due dates. Sometime later in the um, course, we may have some online sessions. We we'll, could use Blackboard Collaborate uh, to conference about essay drafts and topics from time to time. So be sure to look for the screencast um, and lecture videos to help fill in the blanks with a lot of the assignments and provide some context uh, for all the work we're going to be doing this semester. All right, so they'll come in a variety of forms. Some might be in the course units, usually a, the weekly screencasts videos uh, laying out the week's work and some direction I include in an announcement. All right, so just to take you through uh, the syllabus real quick, some of the changes. Um, I did remove the reading notes and I am converting that 100 points, that average into discussion board posts and responses. Um, discussion board post number one and responses will be due this week. I have yet to create those discussion board posts. However, uh, well, the reason why is because I want to get out this. Um, I just wanted to complete this video and send it out to everyone so that um, everybody has an idea of what's happening and, and you can keep moving forward. Obviously, I passed out copies of the articles on Friday. Uh, read and take notes. You'll be ready to discuss in the discussion boards. Um, and uh, for this week and as we move for forward through the with the textbook all right sorry this is my third video in a row this morning it's been kind of an interesting weekend I also made some adjustments to the social practices and participation because um, really uh, in an online environment many of the same components uh, still apply so you want to be prepared you want to log into blackboard regularly uh, you need to demonstrate a sense of engagement with classroom and online activities. And part of being a constructive and helpful peer reviewer, either it's in class or online, is, is just critical in the success of um, all concerned, right? So in a final uh, letter to me, I've kind of changed this around because I don't know if we'll be back in time for final exams. However, uh, the letter will remain the same. It'll just be an electronic upload and I'll Make adjustments as we move forward. Like I said, it is a fluid situation. So uh, that is the changes in the syllabus. You want to make yourself aware of those. Uh, the schedule. Uh, you will notice if you look at the schedule, I have changed our due dates to Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday. I've really rebuilt the eight-week course into an online format. Um, I don't believe it'll be on our best interest to kind of go back and forth given the short time frame we have. So we're just going to plow ahead uh, on an online format with the Tuesday, Friday due date. So please take a look at uh, those. I will make adjustments to due dates and create the discussion board post as we move forward. As you can imagine, this weekend's been a little hectic with new information being uh, distributed by the college and also by our uh, our union uh, as far as best practices keep evolving so um, I may uh, just you know be a bit behind in some of the due dates and discussion boards be patient 
and uh, we'll go from there. Also, on Friday, I mentioned the course folder. So uh, once again, um, you do want to um, make it to the uh, first page here. Our drive account link is here where you can um, access the course uh, folder. You want to make sure that you can add that to your uh, Google Drive account, right? You So that way all the work that will go into that course folder. And I've already created the critical thinking essay where your final draft of the critical thinking essay assignment will be uploaded here for commenting, right? And then you will also head over to the course units, uh, right? in the critical thinking folder down here we have the assignment right so you will come here click on the assignment it is worth 20 percent of your course grade click on write submission in this assignment and here you will copy and paste the link to your gdoc that includes your final draft once your gdoc link is copy and pasted here all you have to do is click submit. So please read instructions carefully. As I mentioned in the announcement, right? In the announcement, as we head there, head there, yes. Reading with purpose and time management are critical. I know everyone can be successful as we move forward in this eight week class, given the circumstances, all right? Um, more will come uh, later in the week. As you see here in the schedule, there'll be a series of videos. One will be a screencast. More than likely, there'll also be a lecture video that'll be included. Um, look for one as we move through the week just to provide some direction for the critical thinking essay. So, like I said, please check your COD email and Blackboard often. Um, Interesting times requires flexibility. There we go. How's that for a profound statement? All right. So stay safe, wash your hands, and have a good day.